Welcome to sold out B&D Spring Stadium in Baltimore, Scaryland. You folks watching from home are in for a real treat today as these teams will look to do the impossible, the unthinkable, and the absolutely unimaginable. Watch that, Grim. Raise Baltimore's already sky-high homicide rate. <laughs> the teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for NFL action. The insane Colts go up against the Baltimore Razors. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Pulled a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban mom on the way to speak to the manager. Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. First and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. And it's a catch for a four yard gain. Second down and six. If he is getting killed by a chainsaw, <laughs> the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah. Probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they got out the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And that'll bring up second and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a great turkey. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. Second down and more. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Brick should have, and the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Third down, and well, good luck. He zings it in there for a four yard gain. Shotgun away from 
from him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. And rolling thunder. And, oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Hot. Ouch! Anyone in the mood for a steak tartare? First and ten. That guy's so fast he can strike lightning. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Not much there, maybe a yard. Third down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And he's off to the races. He's at the 20. But they're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a sub up running on this asshole. I'm a house killer with killer. Extra point, but this guy could blow it. You gotta be kidding me! My sister could have made that kick. Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. He refuses to go down. First and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps upside, trying to mute. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. First and ten. Uh, 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 uh. And the defense falls metric all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Second down and ten. Long. And that was a bone 
crusher right there, folks. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And he breaks away. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Oh, what a punishing hit down. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. A pickup of about three on the... Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. Quarter one. Second down in a very lot. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap, I had money on him fighting a big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is going to kill me. First and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And that'll be second down and four. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? First down and nine. He's not going down. It's about a three yard pickup. Second down and six. Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. Third and two. They're going. 
going for two here. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Yo, man, nobody can touch you on eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's yeah, right. What you talking about? Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grin? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light. It wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Serve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough. It's a real blow to the team. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. First and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Well, speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Now, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. Third down and the punter is warming up. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this kid. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to make it the It'll be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second. 
broken down in a lot. He took a beast boost in jump, and he gets three yards on that run. Third down and ten. You gotta love a player who goes down fighting. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this win. And it's first and ten. Throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeves this morning. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's at the 40. He's at the boom, and he's dead. in his path. Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And he scores! And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. You might consider running the ball more. And it's first and goal. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. right on time when it's your time to go it's your time and it's first and they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game oh nice coaching move there hall of fame caliber well i mean it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game i won't listen to this pass for me he can go all the way <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. Eh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? 
There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wow! The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh boy, where are we going, man? A carnival? Huh? I'm gonna go with our strategic. Hey, why don't you sell down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. to kill the quarterback and the quarterback says I don't think so and runs out of bounds leaving the defense in the dust yeah. nice try fellas but no cigar yeah. first down and in inches huh? First and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck up. That was just a one-time thing. Oh, it's a punishing hit. on that catch. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. <laughs> and it's 
First and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. You can't keep a good mute. And Lynn Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Jeez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck and everybody else combined. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and headed for the end zone. He could go boom. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got dead mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to buy it. Someone better buy this guy dinner tonight because he just saved a touchdown with that tackle. Okay, so bad kill. Jim, hold on. Get on the gun. Get on the gun. It's first and ten. I'm a house camel and sell him. I am a hell and I'll sell him. Second down in a very lot. the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! First down and one. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Man, this guy couldn't hit the side of a fallout shelter. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Building it in drug testing in the end, and he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. At this rate, the QB's gonna have more in Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. He could go all the way! In a league full of undead and monsters, humans have a right to strut their stuff. Hey, man, I was going to kill him now. You know what I... Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Pick! 
First and eight to go. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. <laughs> <laughs> the offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, they kick the kicker's job in half? They just be called straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Second down and ten. Oh, and he just left an outlet. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. Children's Hospital. What a player. Get him out. That is such a moving story. And people say that the NFL players are heartless. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Why turn on the light of and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And the defense was ready for that bomb's way dirty trick that time. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. Bench. 
And it's first and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. I think you ought to be able to shoot a guy in the end zone throwing a dance like that. For extra points, you know? Plus, it would speed the game up. Hey, good point. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again! That ball was almost intercepted! Changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. And it's first and ten. Another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what if interceptions counted as touchdowns? He'd be in the Hall of Fame. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. <laughs> so neither team can put their players on the bench. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. The defense just wanted it more and got it. Kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistake a man. If my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. A little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Oh, man, he really wants it. Two-minute drill. What the hell is that? 
is the same thing as a hurry up offense, you moron. I am and that's another turnover for the defense. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And the defense is on his heels. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. to stop the clock. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And Bricks, you were hit more than a few times like that in your career. 140 times to be exact, and one game to be more exact. During one play to be more and more exact. It wasn't even a game, actually. Coach just laid into me on the sidelines. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. He's supercharged. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. I'm going in circles. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. I was killing a the offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. I know I've said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Leaving a wake of destruction in his path. He's at the 10. Touchdown! And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. Yeah, I saw him at Trader Tech's hotel bar the other night. His hair was perfect. Better watch out. He'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is pop the force of forfeit? Would be correct, Bricks. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. And the Baltimore Razors not only lose at home, they lose by forfeit. Man, that's double the humiliation. Like being rejected by a woman is also, well, bad. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Balin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. 
Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...